Hello, Capola. How many instruments have you gotten so far? When you play the instruments in front of the un, in front of the egg, the wind fish will wake, and you will leave this island. Now you must hasten to the Yarna Desert. The dark, monstrous inhabitants of the sand will show you the way. Halfway to getting to our goal. I'm not gonna pick up any corn. I'd rather have a piece of power, honestly. Nice stick. Oh my, Terran. Behave. Can I borrow it for a second? You can. Uh, Terran. I don't think you really thought this through. Well, okay. The stick became a honeycomb. Not sure how it happened, but take it. Oh, Terran. Crystals. And we can have this treasure. But there's something more important than rupees in here, but you need bombs to get to it. Ah, there it is. 
I knew it was in this cave somewhere. And here we have another heart piece. So I think we can also go ahead and do the Dream Shrine next. Hey, hey, bro. About the Dream Shrine there. They say there's something good inside. I better not say anything else, as I'm just a kid. I see. So hop into the bed, and we start the Dream Sequence. Now, these are another type of enemy that mimic Link's movement, and they're actually pretty strong. They take off a whole heart each. Now, you can't beat them normally because you need... Well, the dash attack kills them instantly, but your sword won't affect them normally unless you do a spin attack. So it might just be a better idea to wait until you have the Pegasus boots to do this part. Having a piece of power affects them too. So first of all, there's a treasure chest here. With 100 rupees in it. Then, breaking that dark crystal, there's another chest on this side that has the ocarina in it. You should learn to play many songs. Okay, we're done, so let's get out of here. You'll now notice that the shopkeeper is selling bow and arrows for 980 rupees, which is kind of a ripoff. I can stock up on some bombs. Yeah, that's a good amount. Well, now that we have the ocarina, let's go ahead and talk to Marin, because so, she'll have a, our first song to learn. Well, it's an ocarina, but you don't know how to play it. Hey, that's a nice ocarina you have there. Will you accompany me as I sing? Touching, isn't it? Does it stick in your mind? Yes, it does. You've learned the Ballad of the Windfish. This song will always remain in your heart. Please remember this song. You should play it every once in a while to keep it fresh in your mem in your mind. Well, we don't know where Talon is since those bees chased him off. The 
angler key, huh? tree that we can dash into for another secret sea shelter. the library. Now you see how there's a book up on the shelf there? Just like in Link to the Past. Gotta dash into it with the Pegasus boots to knock it down. Yeah, let's read it. New World of Color Under the Five Gravestones. Alright, so... Th one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that looks right. Try with all your might. Open a new path. Whoever is worthy receives the power of color. I wonder what the world of color is. Now that combination that it just showed there is a combination that we're going to have to do in the graveyard. And that's going to open up the, the optional color dungeon. Now, that was obviously exclusive to the DX version of this game. there but we can't well technically we could if we jump just the right way but yeah we'll just wait to get it so yeah welcome to the graveyard just watch out for these ghosts i believe they're called minis g-h-i-n-i i think This is the spot where we have to be. The spot where there's five grave gravestones. These ghosts should not take a lot of abuse. Alright, so the first gravestone has to be pushed down, and it's this one. Fifth and final one. 
And there you go. Welcome to the Color Dungeon. Now, if you listen carefully to the music in here, you'll notice that it's actually exactly the same as the Zelda 1 dungeon music. Which is interesting. Our colors are never the same. If I am red, he is blue. If he is red, I am blue. What color is my cloth? Red. It's a secret to everyone. The Fairy Queen is waiting for you. Powder? If not, you must go back. So yeah, those are monsters that hide within the colors. Now here we're gonna have to line it up so that all of these things turn out blue. And we did it. Now this may not seem like a big deal by today's standards, but back in the day this was a big deal because up until this point, Game Boy games were all black and white. Now these platforms you can only hop on, but you can only hop on the green ones three times, the yellow ones two, and the red ones. After that it just becomes a pit. dudes we have to stun by attacking them, and then throw them into the appropriately colored holes. Like that. Green and green, and red and red. Red, match for me. Now for this guy, we need to attack him with magic power. At least while he's in blood spot. the nightmare key. What a greedy fool. You want more power? A buffoon like you might as well give up and go home.
that many of them. It was kind of tough, since he kept stunning us with his shots. Took a couple minutes, but I finally got it. Last time. Blue is safe, yellow is caution, red is danger. Now, that don't really pay attention to what he says. Just keep attacking him, basically. If you leave him be, his color will regenerate, which means he's regaining HP.
I think that thing is called the giant hard hat beetle. At least I think. Well, at any rate, we've cleared the color dungeon, and we get to meet the Fairy Queen. Welcome, Link. I admire you for coming this far. I will give you the power of color. If you want offense, choose red. If you want defense, choose blue. Now, typically it's the safer choice to go for the blue tunic, because that will cut in half all damage that you take. That's especially useful if you're going for the... the extra ending at the end, but I've never really gone for the red tunic, so let's live on life on the edge. You've got the red clothes. Your body is full of energy. I will now take you out. Now our sword will permanently bash enemies away, it looks like. Alright, let's get out of here. I think at this point, we're going to return to the 